Hello everybody, this is Math and Magic. I have some dice with me here today. A dice is a cube, has six faces. This one has a four on the front face and a three on the back face. The other faces are six and five and one and two. Six and one make seven. Five and two make seven. And four and what's on the hidden face? If you can see the front, you know the back, it's three. Have your students stack three dice any way they want to stack them. And then you can come along and say the sum of your hidden faces is 15. Let them try it out. These two faces are hidden. Four and one makes five. These two faces are hidden. Three and two makes five. And that's ten so far. And the bottom is hidden. It's a five. It adds up to 15. So how do you do this? Well, that's seven front and back. Seven front and back. And seven front and back. Three times seven is 21. 21 take away six is 15. If you have trouble with the 21, just say 20. 20 minus 6 is 14. Add your 1 back, 15. Or you can use your chart. 21 minus 6 is 15. A variation of this is to take the top one, let them scramble the bottom one any way they like, and put it on. And amazingly enough, the sum of the hidden faces is still 15. You can take the top one, secretly rotate a little bit and put it back on and now they'll find that the sum of all their hidden faces is now 18 because that's 21 minus 3. 21 minus 3 is 18. Add another dice and now you can say the sum of the hidden faces is now 25. How do you know it? Let them check it out. How do you know it's 25? 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 times 7 is 28. Take away 3 is 25. Thank you very much. Have fun with this. If you're working in a classroom, sponge dice are quieter and they're safer when the kids start throwing them around. Thank you very much. Hope you enjoyed this.